<laughs> Hello, Mr. Yeti. How are you doing today? It's very good to see you again. Yes. He was at my law firm. We closed on his yacht. We helped him with all the legalities and found him some money. So one of the things that we briefly discussed when you purchased your last yacht was not to own it in your name. Reason being that then the jet that you own and any other fine antiquities that you might own, your home, bank accounts that are in your name, if God forbid something happens while you're on the yacht or anybody's on the yacht or the yacht hits anything and there's some sort of liability or any sort of lawsuit that leads to a judgment, we want to make sure that the only thing that they could get to is what's ever in that limited liability company that we're going to form versus if it was in your name, then the sky is the limit. So whatever's in your name then would be um, what they could go after in order to, to get the judgment. This fur, for example, you know, I mean, absolutely, that's valuable. So that'd be something nice on the living room carpet, you know, in front of the fireplace. Not yours, of course, but something like that. So that's valuable. That's why we need to form you a limited liability company to own the next boat. Understood? Okay, great. We're on the same page there.